All right, welcome to the Super Channel. This is Super Pep, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to mod Cyberpunk 2077 uh, version 2.1. And since they updated to 2.1, a lot of people's Cyber Engine tweak is not working. Um, and that's a mod that uh, pretty much a lot of other mods depend on to be able to work so you can get your console up um, there's three steps in this and I'm walking through them here so just bear with me now step one you're gonna make sure you have the newest version of Vortex installed download it at next mods homepage and after you get that installed or updated you're gonna be ready to uh, your cyberpunk will be ready to upset mods All right. then you're gonna download cyber engine tweaks version 1.29.1 now I tried this with version 1.30 uh, and I couldn't get it to work so I just went with 1.29.1 so you're going to want to download at the download link I left down in the description and uh, once you get that in just kind of leave it in your downloads file for right now then in step two, you're going to download Cyber Engine Tweaks version uh, 1.9.0, and you'll get it from the GitHub. And I'll leave the uh, uh, I'll leave the info for it uh, in the description also. All right, and once that uh, Cyber Engine Tweaks version 1.9.0 gets downloaded, you're going to want to open it. So I've already got my downloads folder open. You're going to want to go into set uh, 1.9.0, double click that, and you're going to go into the bin file, x64, plugins, cyber engine tweaks, and then scripts. And then you got an auto exec dot lua. You want to grab that, drag it out onto your desktop. I've already dragged mine out, so I, I'm not going to do it again. Once you get that out on your desktop, just kind of leave it there so you can uh, have it on hand so we can put it in the right area here in just a minute. Now, once you get that done, you're going to want to boot up uh, your Vortex modding tool. Once Vortex modding tool gets up, uh, if you hadn't directed it to your Cyberpunk folder already, or if it's already in there, then you're good. So once you get that up, you're going to click on the Mods tab. Once you get in the Mods tab, um, you'll see what all you have here. Uh, you probably won't have anything. Uh, somebody might, somebody might not. But if you've been playing around with this, you'll have something. If you ain't, you're not going to have anything. So you're going to go to Install from File on the Mods tab. Once you get that in, you're going to see your Cyber Engine Tweaks version 1.29.1 uh, you're going to double click that and then see I've already got it in so it's going to tell you I mean it'll go ahead and put it in but for me it's going to say replace the existing one so I'm just going to cancel out of that because I don't need to do it again apparently so once that gets installed you'll have uh, your cyber engine tweaks version 1.29 uh, linked unto your cyber uh, cyberpunk uh, install now once that's in we're going to go to games and there's your cyberpunk so you want to grab you want to go into your cyberpunk install folder so you're going to go to click the little box there with the three dots on it go to open and go to open game folder once you open your game folder, you're going to go into bin x64 and uh, plugins, then cyber engine tweaks, and then scripts. Once you're in scripts, you're going to go back and grab your auto exec lure that we dragged out to the desktop. You're going to go ahead and kindly drag that up there into that box. Uh, into that folder anyway once you get that into that folder you can go ahead and close that out and then your let's see we're gonna go through that and bear with me and close
use that one and now on my research and going through and trying to get this get the, my mods working right I found out that a lot of people was having that issue and of course I couldn't google it and find out how to do it because the ones I did they were all old so I figured I'd go ahead through and 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 put this on since I got mine working and maybe it'll help out some of the other people maybe get me some subscribers for better content because I know how to mod lots of stuff and well once you get that in like I say I wouldn't try to work this work around with 1.30.1 because I didn't get it to work that way and to me it's a waste of time um, the mod developer that developed uh, Cyber Engine Tweaks uh, he had uh, I guess they didn't install a file with it is what I came across but once you get all of that in uh, once you boot Cyberpunk up and get it going let me jump out of that move my stuff over here so I'm not stuttering all over you're going to want to open your Cyberpunk up and once it gets in come on right, now once the game gets booted up once you get to the next screen it's going to want to give you it's a prompt to pop up and it'll say it wants to bind cyber engine tweaks uh, your console and wants to bind it to a key now most games their game uh, their console key is the tilde key so I just went on ahead and set mine to the tilde key um, other people might want to set it, just set it to whatever you want and uh, once you get that in see not this one Once you get to this next screen, right here is where it pops up and tells you it wants to uh, bind that key. So you can go ahead and do the key binding. Good morning, Night City. And once you Yesterday's get your body count lottery rounded out to a solid it. and start. You're going to want to boot up your game. I'll go to continue. And then it'll get past this little loading screen here, as you can see. Um, Started my missions in Dogwood. Uh, I kind of got mad when I figured out that they nerfed the Sendevastan down to where you couldn't get the good one. So I kind of wanted to mod my Cyberpunk and kind of I wanted to be able to add that in because the best one I had on 2.1 was the uh, Militech Falcon Mark V plus plus and. Um, once you get in, you can see I've already got my modded. I got it in third person mode. And once you get uh, into your game, you'll see that uh, your cyber engine tweaks is working. And that's that. So I hope this video helps out some of you trying to mod your cyberpunk, get it all right. And remember, if you like the content that I provide, I'm getting better. I'm trying my best to get better. Um, if anybody needs any help whatsoever on something that I didn't cover, or if I if I misexplained something, uh, I'm not perfect. I'm trying to get there. Please smash that like and subscribe button for me. I really need the promotion, man. I'm trying to I'm trying to do something I ain't never did. So um, I hope y'all like it. This is Super Pair Up. Thank you for watching the Super Channel, and I'll holler at you.